We're all wondering what will happen when schools and playgrounds are once again open this fall. What kind of outbreaks will happen? It's a conversation Missouri's top public health officials had almost a month ago over emails obtained by KNBC 9 News from the Documenting COVID project at the Brown Institute for Media Innovation. In St. Louis, the health director there gave a list of recommendations. Top on the list, mandatory masks for all ages, something she still believes in today. The majority of schools in St. Louis County right now are virtual. Um, I do have a mandatory mask mandate um, for St. Louis County. Meanwhile, in Springfield, the public health director called seated education a total fantasy for the fall. Monday, he clarified that comment to KNBC, saying he was expressing his concern about full week seated classes like we had pre pandemic. Now he's recommending a split cohort model to allow students to attend at least a couple of days a week. Meanwhile, Kansas City's Dr. Rex Archer said over email he doesn't believe any of us will have the resources to manage outbreaks in the schools and community spread this fall. Monday, he clarified that comment to KNBC, saying resources are still stretched thin, trying to control outbreaks in nursing homes, healthcare workers, and meatpacking facilities. The schools actually fall way down on the priority list in regards to our ability to even manage the outbreak. Dr. Archer said he has given approval to a split cohort model to allow kids to come to school at least a couple of days a week, saying it's important that we all do our best to make sure kids can stay in school through the fall. Matt Fleener, KBC 9 News.